Hello, I'm Evgeny Yelisev, a teacher of Russian language from RussianWithRussian.com. We continue our conversation about Russian hashing consonants. Today, we will talk about the letter SHA. Well, let's go. If we extend the sound CH, we will obtain the sound SH. To specify this soft hissing consonant, that is very similar to sh in English, we use the letter sha. For example, shedri, shuka, shi, plush, plush, budushi. Please note, this sound becomes long when it appears between vowels, one of which is stressed. For example, pisha. The sh is located between the vowels e and r, one of which the e is stressed. That's why here the sh is long, pisha, pishala. The sh is located between two vowels e and r, one of which the r is stressed. So here the sh is long, pishala. Ishu. The sh is located between the vowels e and u, one of which the u is stressed. So here it's long too. Ishu. There are some exceptions, but we will talk about them in one of the next lessons. Let's see some more examples. Chishu, Rosha, Nishi, Pishera. Pushu, ishi, but, morshu. Here the sh is short because it's not located between two vowels. Morshu, znayushi. Here the sh is short because none of the vowels that surround this sound are stressed. Znayushi. Like che o and che yo. Sha o and sha yo have the same pronunciation. Compare, for example, sho, shors, trushoba, sho, shoki, krishoni. And now read please the following words. Well, the time is over. Let's check. Shit, pishat, prishuriu, sheli, shotka, plashom. And now you know 29 Cyrillic letters. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, subscribe to my channel, and visit my website to get more information about the Russian language and private Russian lessons on Skype. Thank you. Have a nice day. See you at the next video. 